We're here in the New York Liberty locker room with Essence Carson, who had a season-high 16 points in the Liberty's win over the San Antonio Stars here this afternoon at Madison Square Garden. Now, you came off the bench for the first time in 2015. What was that like for you today in the win over San Antonio? Yeah, it wasn't like anything, you know. Um, he wanted to change the, uh, the lineup, work on some things. Um, I had no problem with it, as long as, you know, we can get things done and uh, come out with the win. I'm, I'll go along with it. Now, coming here today, I figured you would be in the starting lineup. So when did you find out that you would be coming <laughs> off the bench today? Oh, yesterday. You know, he let you know in advance. <laughs> no, but, you know, it, it, was, uh, it was something that he felt needed to be done just to mix some things up. And, um, you know, moving forward, you might see that a lot more, you know, changes in some things. You know, we might make a game day decision. It doesn't matter, but just know that we're a team with depth, so anyone can step up and get things done. You've done both in your career, come off the bench and start. So is it a different mentality for you coming off the bench like you did today? Um, for me, no. For me, it's not a different mentality. To me, when I play, I, I play my hardest at, every, you know, every second of the game. You know, um, I know some people, they, they like coming off the bench because they get to see the flow of the game, you know, and then they get to come in the game and, uh, you know, see the, uh, do the things that they saw happening out there. Uh, for me, it really doesn't make a difference. Um, you know, I'm, I'm ready to go to work you know, at, at any moment in time. It doesn't matter whether it's one second left in the game, you call my number, or whether, you know, it's when the ball's going up in the air. Now, 11 a.m. start today. Are you a morning person? Because I know I had trouble getting out of bed this morning. <laughs> no, I'm not really a morning person, but, you know, due to, you know, my career, uh, I'm forced to be a morning person. If I could sleep in, I would. But, you know, I'm pretty used to getting up early each and every day. But uh, I think I do like uh, night games better. I just heard Kia saying outside that it feels right now like it's 10 o'clock at night. Does, it, does that have that same feeling to you? Uh, yeah, it does. <laughs> it's because we're used to playing at 7, 7.30, getting out of here about 10, 10.30. And, you know, right now, what is it? I don't even know what time it is. I'm so confused. <laughs> I am too. I have no clue. Screaming kids, 11, 11 o'clock start. I'm confused. I don't even know what time it is. <laughs> now, you guys just came off a pretty good road trip, 2-1. You play Connecticut tomorrow and then another road trip, three games before the All-Star break. How important is it for you guys to keep that momentum going into the All-Star break? Oh, it's definitely very important. Um, we, we, we have a good start to this road trip already. I mean, um, we have great momentum. We have great momentum right now, and we just want to continue to take it into the All-Star break. Because, um, you know, people are going to have their time to practice together, you know, work on things and stuff like that. We want to have a head start. And right now, it looks like things are looking good for us, and we want to keep it rolling, man. Essence, thank you for a few minutes, and congrats on the win. Thank you.